Hey guys, it's Lance at Max Sound Solutions, and today Apple has released Sequoia 15.2. Now I've had some people on my YouTube channel say, oh, having your home folder on the external drive will get messed up when you do a Mac OS update. And I say, no, absolutely not. It is supported by Apple to have the external home folder, the external user, like I have over here with my custom icon, Home X. There is the user I'm logged into at the moment. I have another user on here, but I'm not logged into that. Hence why the little house is on this user. So Lance X is my external user at the moment on my Zyke drive. So now we're gonna just update and see what happens because I'm currently running 15.1.1. So we're gonna hit update now. We're gonna agree. We're gonna put in our user password and away she goes. And I am connected via ethernet. It's moving right along, 56 seconds. The benefit of not doing it over Wi-Fi. Let's see what kind of download speeds we're getting. We're getting 50, 63 megabytes per second. Oh, now it's gonna take 30 minutes and it's in that stuck mode. This happens all the time with Apple and their OS releases. We're just gonna let it ride, folks, let it ride. See, download is complete. I gotta confess, I've had a couple of beers. I was not intending on making a video tonight, but at least you know I'm not an AI. And I'm sorry, I apologize, I'm only human. If you have Pro Tools, Avid Link is a real memory hog. And when I quit Avid Link, it just jumped ahead. The 30 minutes went away and it was done. Very strange. So now we're rebooting and macOS 15.2 is doing whatever it needs to do. That looks like a firmware update. I mean, what is with the ginormous Apple? Yeah, folks, this is a firmware update. Okay, our firmware update is apparently done and we are now rebooting into macOS 15.2. Gonna speed this up a bit. Sign into your Apple account. Something new and different. Zyke drive is warm. It's not burning hot. Mac mini, way less heat. Acasis, pretty warm, but it's got dual NVMEs in it. So, you know, we'll cut it some slack. Let's see what old Time Machine is doing. Is it doing anything at the moment? It's backing up now, see? Time Machine detected an update and it's doing a backup. Look at our RAM pressure, next to nothing. So as you can see, there were no issues updating my system, which also did a firmware update while I have my user on the external drive. If you followed my other videos, you know what I'm talking about. And I decided to edit this video down because I had some burps and bleeps in there that I shouldn't have had. And I don't think they were appropriate for my channel. So 60 people did see the video. I never meant to have the video go public. I was just thinking about it and somehow it did go public for a little bit. And in like one minute, 60 people viewed the video. So. You know, part of me wanted to leave it up, but I decided better on it because I've got sponsors that are sending me stuff and I don't want to misrepresent them or myself. So anyway, thanks for tuning in. I got a new video about Time Machine coming up next. It's about how to back up your external home folder and your internal data. See you in the next one.